happy Tuesday. This is the first clip of the vlog. You're gonna hear Dora in the background because you know she's with me today. Say hey, Squirrely. Say hey, Squirrely. Squirrely. Oh man. Say hello, Squirrely. There you go. <laughs> Sometimes she can be a terrible two. We are headed to the good old gym. She's going with me today. This will be her second time. The first time, I don't think I gave y'all an update, but she loved it. Like, she came out, she was like, thank you, mommy. I'm like, you're welcome, kid. <laughs> Whatever makes you happy, free 99. So, she liked it. We're going to take it. I'm going to take her back again today. I'm going to try to do it once a week with COVID and everything. Like I said, I'm not going to do it as often. I'm still going to restrict it to once a week. And then she'll probably stay with my aunt the other days. If I go days, plural, to the gym. Other than that, we are doing fabulous this week. Um, we had a little workout. Y'all probably saw that. We did that together today right before we left. That was cute because she wanted to do it. Even though the band wasn't around her ankles where it was supposed to be. It was around her waist. She didn't know the difference. <laughs> it was still cute. She's still... Uh, this week, I've actually been doing well with eating as well. Water, too. Water's been good. Um... I haven't started my cycle for some reason. It's so weird. I stopped birth control. I know this is a little TMI, but I stopped birth control and I think I'm like a couple of days late and you know, I know I'm not pregnant. So it's really weird, but um, we're gonna see if it comes around. I'm not for sure when, I don't know what's going on. Maybe it's just my hormones trying to catch up with itself or trying to figure out this new way of living. I don't know. I'm just pretty much rambling right now, for real. Trying to find a parking spot at the gym because we just pulled in. Hey, gym. So, I'm going to get in here. If I can film some with our um, class because I'm going to Tim's class today. It's Tuesday. Then I will. You know how I do. If it's not crowded, I'll film. If it is crowded, there's no way I'm going to sneak in a workout. So, I will talk to you all later. I don't have any yet new updates. If I do, if I remember anything, I'll come back and vlog. But right now, I really can't think of anything new to tell you all. So, I'll let you all go. Toodles. Happy Thursday, guys. I didn't turn on the camera yesterday. What was yesterday? Wednesday, I did a class at the gym. It was foundation. I also did a workout morning yesterday morning i believe yeah so i did two workouts yesterday morning before work and then i went to the gym after work um today i took a rest day because this one squirrely wave say hello no she just got a day here so you know how she is it takes her a minute before she starts um waving and being happy are you happy yeah all right what are we about to go do you're gonna go gymnastics yay yeah, girl you ready yeah. all right you're gonna listen with your ears yeah. okay so today is her first day um, doing gymnastics I'm kind of excited cuz me I was a tomboy so I was into sports like basketball softball I did soccer one year and then I did shot and disc in high school on the track team but that that was me that was my layout and then growing up my mom didn't have enough money to like put us in any activities like at an early age so it was more so when we were like pre-teens when we started doing actual activities outside the home uh act yeah pre-teens yeah sixth fifth sixth grade um so i just been dipping and dabbling with her with different sports so we did soccer We've done swim classes, and now I'm taking on gymnastics. I kind of want her to enjoy it because it's more on the girlier side, I guess you can say. I'm a little nervous to go in here, to be honest, because I have no clue about gymnastics or flipping or any of that. I don't know what I'm doing. I was a basketball player, softball, all that other stuff, anything that involved a ball, put it that way. But with this, it's going to be a whole new avenue. So I'm kind of a little nervous, and then I have to do it with her until she's three years old. And then when she turns three, she'll be going to the classes on her own which will be better for me but so we have five months before she's um three years old and i thought i was gonna sign her up at three just so i didn't have to do it but then i was thinking you know what so she can kind of dip her toes in it get used to it because some of these other girls i don't know how long they've been doing gymnastics 
and she kind of needs to know the basics so if i do it with her she'll be comfortable and then at three she can go on about her way and do it on her own so i was just like let me go ahead and do these five months and quit being cheap so we're here and we'll see how this goes i wish i could film it so that we can see her reaction to her first day my aunt's gonna be here she's gonna be a spectator to see you know from the outside what it's gonna be like um so hopefully she'll capture some images so that i can kind of put them in the clip as well but i'm so excited for her because she gets to do stuff that i didn't get to do growing up and i'm excited for her. i'm gonna do what i can to get her involved with different stuff like this because it's important to have kids active as well i know corona is going around and a lot of people are worried about that which i am too but still at the end of the day i can't hinder her from growing and you know being a kid so i don't want to take that away from her just because of the virus and i know the virus is very very much so real it's just still we can be safe and still be able to enjoy some of the things we want to do like gymnastics traveling you know stuff like that so that's where i'm at with everything when it comes to the corona and then having my child being involved with diff around different people and stuff like that they're wearing masks i think five years and up that's what they're doing so we all have to wear a mask if you're over the age of five or five and up uh, but yeah other than that we didn't have much to do today tomorrow's friday thank god so i'll have either one or two workouts tomorrow i'm not for sure if i'm gonna do that second one or not i might just do in the morning we'll see how my mood is because i got a couple of things to do tomorrow after work um yeah i got like three things i need to do after work so i don't know how that's gonna play out but I was just touching base with everyone, just let you know I'm here. And I am going to do a haul soon for leggings for plus size women. It is so hard to find leggings. I just bought some mm, a women's best. So I'm going to do a women's best versus old navy leggings because that's the only ones I have that I truly know work for me. Um, I'm going to do like a a try on haul that'll be my first one so i'm excited about that and the package arrived today i was like what it came all the way from germany but look out for that video soon so that i will be posting that just in case someone really wants to see the difference between the leggings we, who doesn't like leggings i mean i live in leggings day in day out casual not casual all the above leggings are my friends yes they're my friends but Anyways, I'm going to let you all go because I'm rambling and I need to get in here so I can see where we need to go, how we need to do things, and make my payment. All right. Talk to you guys later. Bye-bye. Say bye-bye, squirrels. Bye-bye. Yeah, girl. Say have fun. Have fun. All right.